Perry Lake white bass. Look at that chunk. What happened was I was trolling around for blue cat and I went through a school or something and I got cracked on my cut bait and it was a pretty good white bass so I came back and I'm working over the school with a spoon. If you find a school, they usually don't sit there for long. You might pop a couple of them out of it, and then they move, and it's all over, and then it takes you two hours to find another one. So with this spoon, you can, man, you can just rip them in quick and get them off the hook and pitch it back out there and get down quick like that. But these are staying put. Well, I've caught I don't know how many out of this school, and they're just staying here. Just casting up onto a point where I seen the school of white bass, and it's just a hard bottom point. I guess it's a point flat, whatever you call it. Area that juts out into deep water, shallow on top, drops off into deep water, and they're right out at the tip, dropping off into the deep water. They're probably I don't know, 14 to 17 feet deep. I'm just casting out, letting it sink all the way to the bottom. It takes a few seconds. Tonk, I felt it hit the bottom. And I'll rip it a couple times, let it sink back down to the bottom. Rip it a couple times. Dink, tap the bottom. And then I'm feeling for a little tick as it's falling. And then I'll set the hook. Or it'll, the fish will just be there when you rip it up. See what I did there? I lost the school. The school moved. So I just cast, you know, in a different area. And always watch for your casting. Like I was aiming at a specific tree way on the other side of the bank. And now I know that that school is probably still there. So I'll try to put my spoon in the same spot. Repeat that cast. You know, if you don't want to move your boat over there. See if they'll sit there for 15 minutes like they did last time. Oh, there's a hit. Come on. Oh, yeah, there it is. And you notice I'm hammering them in really fast. Because you only got so much time and they'll move, so got to take advantage of it. What's up, little guy? 